I think the image of Eve is so ingrained in our society and it's almost gotten so prevalent that you can't see it because it's everywhere. You see Eve in advertising, you see Eve in media, whether it's billboards or television ads or radio spots, but um, I think to this day, uh, women still struggle with that baggage that's been put on them. But I think today there has been a lot of uh, advancement thanks to women stepping out and writing and speaking and starting conversation about, uh, about the story, understanding the harm, the misogyny, the miscommunications that's come out of that ancient story. I'm struck by the woman in the hard hat. She, she looks like she's dressed up in her daddy's construction outfit. And that's so, such a contrast to the image next to it. She's powerful, she's in a powerful stance, she has a serious look on her face and is obviously quite competent. You know, you gotta wonder, who would you rather build your house? The blonde woman on the left, contrasted to the other image, uh, raises for me issues of gender and race. I mean, I, my first question is, could they have found a whiter model? I mean, this woman needs some vitamin D. The woman on the right is obviously a teacher, but in a powerful position, a woman who is empowering young women, inspiring young women. The photo of the woman holding the drill, I, I really only have one word, really, I mean, really? The image on the right, however, is a woman that's portrayed as strong, competent. She's standing maybe in her own house, doing work on her own house. I, frankly, I wish that woman on the right would take her drill and chase off the woman on the left. I am so disappointed, <laughs> but not shocked on these images of women in faith. I mean, that's it. The only image that we have of women in, as leaders in the church are like a school mom in Little House on the Prairie. And that's so sad to me. And I think that that's a, a manifestation of a reality in the church, a reality in religion as a whole, uh, that women aren't able, aren't invited to share the gifts that they've been given. I wish and I would love to see women imaged um, as leaders of faith in all the different gifts that they bring. Maybe, uh, you know, you'd see a woman in a powerful position in the pulpit preaching a message and seeing the people reacting, hearing, uh, receiving that gift. You might see a woman laughing hysterically with some colleagues within the church. You might see a woman studying, reading the Torah or the Bible. All of the different aspects of ministry that should be represented as opposed to the, the, the very narrow area that women are always relegated to which is maybe a children's ministry or maybe, a, maybe making the lunch. And that's it. And I want to see a broad-based image. I want to see, to see all the gifts that women bring.